Yo, what's going down, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, Dudes Outdoor. Once again, we coming at you with another unboxing, y'all, by Six Cents. Um, a few things that I had to restock on, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be short and sweet. I'm actually on my way to the water, but I figured I figured that I'd film this and uh, show you guys a few things that I picked up from the six, y'all. So let's crack this box open. If you're new to the channel, make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time we drop a video, y'all. So let's dive up in this box and so I can show y'all what I got. Let's get it, baby. Can't wait, man. It's gonna be perfect, too, to get down on the water today. Perfect for me to get out on the water. I'll be able to use everything that's in this box on the water today and we'll start off with uh what i have in this little pouch here <clears throat> actually it's a dope nice little pouch i've actually never received one of these little guys look at that dope super super dope right there with the six on there with the skeleton fish yes let's bust it open so i'll show you guys what i got up in here i've been using these i've used them plenty of times but lately I don't know what it is in the area I've been fishing, man. They've been tearing this up right here. So I had to recop on the Divine Hybrid Jig, y'all. Six cents Divine Hybrid Jig. I got me a half ounce and a three eighths. Both of them in Grass Mutant. I'm going to open one up so I can show y'all real quick. Grass Mutant right here. I don't know what it is about this uh, color or what it is, but... And it really gets it. It really gets them. Look at that, y'all. Check that out. Look at that. I don't know if it's focusing on that, but man. Open one of these up. We got some green. We got some brown. And we got a like a highlight, like a bluegill. Some strands of some blue in there, highlights, and uh, it really, it really, uh, it's really like a blue gate, a blue gate, excuse me, a bluegill forage. So that's what I imitate with it, anyways. So, yep, that's what I picked up. I picked up, uh, so this, like I said, the half ounce, the three eighths, the hybrid, hybrid jig in the grass meat meal. I got a few other things in here. And can't go wrong without, can't go, <clears throat> excuse me, can't get on the water without one of these bad boys right here. Divine Swim Jig, y'all. Divine Swim Jig. This is a half ounce. I was trying to get the three eighths, but they were all sold out of the three eighths. So I picked up the quarter. I picked up the quarter ounce and I picked up the half ounce, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and open one of these up. We'll pick, we'll open up the uh, quarter ounce. Grass Mutant, same thing. That one's just a hybrid jig, so it's a it's a, it's a um, combination between a um, a football jig, I believe. What to say? I've seen it. I've seen it. On, I read it on the website. Between a um, a skipping jig, a football jig, and all, a few different kind of jigs that are combined, which create this here right here. This is the hybrid, and then you got the swim jig right here. The swim jig. Look at that head right there, y'all. With the eyes on there. Realistic 3D eyes. <sighs> Color on here is amazing. Solid stout hook right there. You got the screw keeper right here. See that right there? Screw keeper. You are not losing your trailers. They ain't giving up without a fight, y'all. Swim jig right here, y'all. So I picked up pretty much on the swim jigs. And then I had to go ahead and pick me up one of these uh, Green Pumpkin Blue Crushes, y'all. Green Pumpkin Blue Crush, another one of my favorites. I've been killing them on the water with lately. So I figured I'd go ahead and pick this one up as well. And let's open this bad boy up. Same thing, it's a hybrid jig. So you can see the front, look at that front. See the way that shape coming through everything right there you could use this i i swim these too just like a swim jig take the little piece off and uh and uh, voila 
in there like swimwear, baby. In there like swimwear. Got a nice weed guard right here. Perfect. I like to trim it down just, just slightly. Just so when I rub my finger over there. Boom. So that's what that is, y'all. And last but not least. Some of these, y'all. Had to pick me up. Another pair of Waterland sunglasses. Man, if you don't know about it, please learn about it. I actually already had me a pair of these, but I lost them. Just putting in work, being on the grind on the water. Man, they went overboard, man. They went overboard. And uh, yeah, I lost them. So <clears throat> with that being said, I went ahead and ordered me another pair. I'm going to open these up. The first pair I had, you might have seen me wearing on some of my videos. Um, they were called the Hey Bros. These ones are called the So Bros. So we're going to check these out. No way, shape, or form am I sponsored by Six Cents or Waterland. Is this me showing you guys some of the stuff I like to use while well, I'm on the water. Good quality product, y'all. So go check them out by any means. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Boom. Comes in a solid little case. Pretty solid case, too. Pretty solid case, y'all. Let's see what they look like. I know I like the Hey Bros. The Hey Bros I have for a while. I actually had them longer than any pair of glasses that I've owned because I'm, I'm bad with these. I'm super bad with glasses. I lose them. So I'm going to go ahead and keep my hands on these. I'm going to grip these babies tight. I'm actually going to order me a six cents. Uh, I don't know exactly what they're called, but you, you put them on the, back of their on the back of the glasses. And they go over your neck just in case you lean over. It don't fall directly into the water, y'all. But... Look at this. Y'all ready? <clears throat> Boom. Woo! These bad boys are nice and sleek. Oh, yeah. Look at that. The way that opens up right there. Look at that. Look at that. Good quality hinge right there off top. Got the Waterland logo on the side. Waterland Sobro. Sobro. See, it says right there on the inside. You got the uh, rubber right here on the nose so they're not slipping off. Got a little bit of rubber on the back right here so it's nice and gripped. And it got that arch right here so it's going to go down behind my ear. Sometimes the other ones I had, they were I, I wore, they were perfect. I'm not really complaining about it. But they came out straight so sometimes it kind of it interfered with the back of my hat. These ones are probably going to ride it a little bit more better, y'all. But let's throw these puppies on. Ooh, man, get you a pair of these Waterland sunglasses for being on the water. These are the green ones right here with the copper base. I like them because I'm a, uh, I like to say I'm like, a, a I, I like to fish shallow. So these right here are perfect so I can see through the water. I'm able to see if a fish is following my bait when I'm doing some glide bait, swim baits, all of that, or for any kind of bait for the fact, <clears throat> for that fact. But man if you don't know about it learn about it waterland go pick you up a pair of these bad boys Whew, i promise uh, and it comes with a little thing right here so you guys can keep your lens nice and clean while you're on the water or just really wearing these wherever because i the other pair i had I, I wore them wherever so nice and stylish man shout out to uh waterland for supplying us with a dope product that we could wear on the water and we could rely on y'all. So like I said, no way, shape, or form am I sponsored. Just showing love and showing you guys the things I like to use when I'm on the water, y'all. But that's about it. We're going to go ahead and wrap it up. Hey, if you're new to the channel and you like the content, hit that bell. Hit that thumbs up. All of that, y'all. Subscribe to the channel. Last but not least, thank you for stopping by. Till next time. Mm -hmm.